video, you will learn how to round numbers to the nearest ten and the nearest hundred. We have to round these two numbers to the nearest ten. Nearest tens are multiples of ten, like ten, twenty, thirty, forty, and so on. We can see from the number line that both of these numbers are between the multiples 20 and 30. But 23 is closer to 20 and so rounds down to 20. On the other hand, 28 is closer to 30 and so rounds up to 30. As a rule, if the number in the ones place is 4 or less than 4, the number rounds down. If the number in the ones place is 5 or more than 5, the number rounds up to the next 10. Rounding is a very important concept and you will use it in many of your math courses. You can use this rule of rounding to help you round any number to any given place value. Now let's try some more examples. Round to the nearest ten. First, we underline the digit in the tens place. We circle the digit to the right. Then, using the rules of rounding, if the digit is less than four, the number in the tens place stays the same, and this number rounds to 20. If the number in the ones place is 5 or more than 5, we let it soar, which means we plus 1 to the number in the tens place, and this becomes 30. Let's try some more examples. Round to the nearest 10. Again, underline the digit in the tens place. Circle the number to the right. 7 is more than 5, so we add 1 to the 6 in the tens place. And that becomes 70. We don't touch the numbers before the tens place. Again, you can look at a number line to help you understand. 267 is found between the multiples 260 and 270, but clearly it's closer to 270. One final example of rounding to the nearest 10. Underline the digit in the tens place. Circle the number to the right. 3 is a small number, so the digit in the tens place stays the same, and the numbers to the left of the tens place stays the same. Now let's try some examples of rounding to the nearest hundred. Nearest hundreds are multiples of hundred, like 100, 200, 300, 400, and so on. So now, this time, we underline the digit in the hundreds place. Again, circle the number to the right. Two is a small number, so the four will stay the same. And we replace the numbers to the right with zeros. The answer is 400. Again, if you want to have a look at the number line, 423 is between the multiples 400 and 500. But clearly, it's closer to 400. One final example. Round to the nearest 100. And you know by now, underline the digit in the hundreds place. Circle the number to the right. 6 is more than 5, so we plus 1 to the number in the hundreds place and then replace with zeros. The final answer 1500. Thank you.